The Robert Morris Colonials officially open their Northeastern Conference slate this Saturday against the Sacred Heart Pioneers. Even though the loss to Dayton in their opener is still hanging upon them, the Colonials seem very optimistic. The Colonials head into Saturday's game brimming with confidence in themselves and how they will perform. Very confident in my team. Uh, we're looking a lot better from last week's game. Uh, practice this week has been going very well. A uh, lot, lot more enthusiasm this week. We want to go out and get the win. The team looks to come into the game with the suitable amount of preparation, both physically and emotionally. Um, I think we're emotionally prepared every single week. We're always on the hype. We can get loud. We can roo rah roo rah you know. And as you probably heard a million and one times, uh, the game of football is 99% mental, you know, and 1% physical. Robert Morris will have to shore up some of their weak points prior to this weekend's game, but that is a task the team is up for. I think right now, uh, any football team early in the season, you know, weakness is going to be communication with each other on the field because it's something that you need a couple games to get into. As is always the case, the Colonials look to leave the field on Saturday with a victory. At the end of the day, every game you want to leave with a victory. Uh, but not with an easy win. You want to fight for it, and you want to leave it all on the field. So uh, we want to win. We want to win. That's what we need. It's a first conference game, um, and so that means a lot to us. And we really want to win the NEC championship, and so it starts here. Their perseverance, hard work, and confidence will hopefully shine through for them. In the words of Marvin McCullough, the game of football is 99% mental and 1% physical. Jackie King, Colonial Sports Center.